What are you guys doing? I'm gonna make a homemade bumblebee so I can show the kids about cross-pollination and so that I can get the perfect bumblebee shot that I've always wanted to get but can never get because of my morbid fear of bumblebees. These are the wings. You see this tape? Hold on, check this out. And to get realism, we need, we need the, the, the ribs down the down the wings like that. Like that, yeah. Here. Okay, that's pretty good, that's it. Oh yeah, like that's that. really good. Okay, here. Down like this. Uh, which way was it, like this? I think the ribs actually go the other way, but whatever. Okay, now. We could use a egg yolk. No, 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 no. This is the body. Gotta put the stripes. Me. Uh, no, you can't be trusted with a sharpie. You've already proven that. Two. Hold on. One more. One Two. more. Two. Smart kid. Two. And bumble three. <laughs> there we go. Boom. Yes. Me. Okay, hold on. And we need the we need its little the little thing for the pistol. So I got. David. It doesn't matter. No one's gonna know what it is. And there's a reason why I need something made out of cotton. If we had had Q-tips, oh, I wouldn't have had to use this. No one is gonna know what, what is this it is. Gonna be for? You'll you'll see when I make the video together. There's a specific reason why I need a cottony substance. There we go. Yes. Okay. Now, here is our bumblebee. You can play with it. Don't break it. Part two, coming up. The final piece de la resistance is we screwed a little screw into the back of the bumblebee so that we can clamp it with the GoPro and get the POB shot. <laughs> that was actually really good. <laughs> Zap! Don't panic, Lila, there's a bumblebee right behind your head. It's not real. This is not a real bumblebee? Have you seen this bumblebee? Ever since I've gotten into photography, I've always been trying to capture the perfect bumblebee. Hi, Chloe. Perfect Hi. bumblebee mid-flight, entering a flower, Hi. then leaving a flower, and I've taken like thousands, well, hundreds of pictures. Led to some awesome high five bumblebees. It's a nice looking flower you got there, bumblebee. High five. Booyah. Have a good day. But today, because I can't actually get the shot, I'm going to make the shot. With a homemade bumblebee, we are going to illustrate how bumblebees take the seed from one flower to the next and make new flower babies. What do you guys say? We're doing it anyhow. Ever since the dawn of humankind, humans have yearned not to fly, but to be a fly. <sighs> Cue dramatic music for the bumblebee. Whoosh! <laughs> get outside, get the pollen all over the end of it. Oh! Oh! Where are you going? Now look at this, guys. This is the important. Look at the tip. We don't see any pollen on this. Let's go to another flower. Look, look at the pollen. Do you see the pollen on the end of that? And then it takes this is the seed, and then it goes to another one. It goes. Oh, look at that! That's a juicy ball. Oh, look how much pollen he's got. Where are you going? 
not our car. Hey, you're getting too close to my flower. I will sing you. Now I must go to the beehive. Get, get out of there! Let's go to school. And that, children, is how baby plants are made. Please. Yep, and. That's the point, that's the point, that's the point. What? Okay, peace out. <laughs>